really regretting working today. I was able to move some of the stains over here. Nathan, how do you feel? It's super hot. What's going on guys? Out here with another detail. This is Edgar and Nathan with the Grind Don't Stop. So, uh, we actually didn't bring our generator because we thought the customer would have electricity, but he did not. So we actually had to go back. So that wasted about 10, 15 minutes of our day. But we're gonna go, go at it. This is an interior shampoo. Um, more of a full detail inside just with interior shampoo. So we'll show you what it looks like in a moment. Doing that full detail on the inside. Nick is working on the shampoo. It's been a very high, guys. Really regretting working today. How's it going, Nathan? Ah, uh, it's going all right. I was able to move some of the stains over here. Um, that was vomit stains, but I came out pretty easily. I'm just doing the extraction now. Seems like it's coming out pretty nicely. But uh, it's hot out here. <laughs> We're sweating so much. I uh, kind of forced Nathan to take a break. He didn't want to take a break, but I was telling him now we got to. Uh, yeah, I just want to finish the job and get out. But uh, the, the, the break did feel nice, so I, I can't complain too much. Yeah, but all we got done, all, all, all we need now is just a shampoo and uh, shine on the car. And that's gonna be a wrap. And I believe we're charging him 160. Should have been like two and a half, three hours of the work, but I think it's gonna take us a little bit longer just because of how hot it is. And I think we're at least at least I feel like I'm working a little bit slower than usual. Alright, we'll keep you guys updated. We're done with this car. Here's the, the final touches, the business cards, and the air freshener. Just a little extra that we do. Now I'm just gonna pack up the cord and got the vacuum, but we're ready to go. About to touch the customer. All right, so we just finished up. Nathan, how do you feel? Yeah, like this. Um, it's super hot, but um. It's just hard to work fast when it's just so hot, the sun's beating down on you. It's like, it makes you feel like slow, moving slow. So, uh, it took about three hours. Right. I was uh, expecting it to take only two hours, maybe two and a half. But we had to go back for a generator and then uh, we had to go back for some water just because he didn't really have an outlet outside. Well, he did, but it was like inside the house, like underneath the house. So I was like, yeah, I don't want to crawl under there to get water or anything like that. So we went nearby to our house uh, to get some water. Yeah, luckily we live, or I live, uh, around the corner. So, or, so it was just easy to get, get the generator and get the water. Right. But yeah, we definitely on the charge on this one. We charged 160 uh, for three hours worth. And it ends up being six man hours, I guess you could say. Uh, it's up being around $26 an hour, so once you take into account the chemicals, uh, the time, the gas, and taxes, and all that stuff, it adds up and definitely lost, maybe lost money on this one, I guess, compared to like working at a, like a regular day job. Um, I, I'm definitely going to be a little bit better. I should have given him a range. It was a little bit dirtier, just a little bit, just because of all the stains, uh, but it just took longer because of how hot it was. Uh, this is our first like summer car, I guess you could say, where it's like extremely hot that we work on together. So we're gonna have to keep that in mind as well. So we're about to get some lunch right now, and uh, Nathan's gonna go finish up a car from yesterday, right? Uh, yeah, the commercial account that we uh, have. Um, I did a, a good vacuum. 
Come on in, I just need to finish. Um, clean up the, the door panels, train the center console, all that. So I just want to go ahead and finish that out. All right, so it's the next day. Unfortunately, super hot today too. Uh, we did the shampoo yesterday on that vehicle that we showed you. And yeah, uh, we didn't make as much money as we could, but it was definitely uh, good. It was a neat customer. It was actually a referral uh, from one of my brothers. We're pretty happy that we got the referral. Um, we're kind of changing things up. We're trying to maybe detail more in the morning now before we were starting our day at nine or sometimes 10, but we're gonna start doing details at eight and try to work as fast as possible. That way, you know, before it gets 12, uh, we're not working anymore because it's getting super hot. I want to say that day it was around like 100, 102. Do you remember, Nathan? It was high 90s for sure. Yeah, yeah it, it was it was super hot and I didn't have uh, too much cold water, so I was dying out there. But yeah, we got it done. Uh, we got it done, definitely. Uh, we got paid for it, it was, it was a good day um, overall. Um, but yeah, the Texas summer heat, it's, it's brutal. It's brutal. Uh, we're thinking about getting a canopy. Uh, that's definitely something we want to do, however, we still wouldn't want to see if we get maybe like sandbags to put on there to kind of help out um, because we don't want the wind to pick up the canopy. Uh, we've heard a lot of uh, horror stories, I guess you could say, of canopies just flying off and damaging the customer's uh, paint. So we definitely don't want to do that. So we don't want to have to, you know, contact our insurance or anything like that. But yeah, we're going to do that pretty soon because Texas heat, it's, it's bad. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, thank you so much for watching the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Hope you guys enjoyed watching me suffer, watching me and Nathan suffer in the heat. Um, yeah, it was, it was a good day overall. Uh, subscribe to our video, to our, our channel, I mean. Uh, subscribe um, to our TikTok, follow us on TikTok and Instagram. And thank you guys for much for watching. If you have any comments, suggestions, go ahead and leave them in the comments below. Thank you so much.